Hi friends, I'm here in my workroom slash YouTube studio slash long-term pantry room. That's the closet. I showed that in the last video. So I thought I'd show these number 10 cans I got from Amazon in the past two years. They are the Augustin Farms brand. And I thought I'd do this in two videos. This video will show you everything that I have. And then the second video, I'm going to uh, show you what I did to track this and determine which ones I was going to buy. So the first reason I did this was that I divided my pantries into three, my regular pantry, my extended pantry, and my long-term pantry. So I know for my long-term pantry, I wanted to have some freeze-dried number 10 cans, also stuff that I would can. So I've done a lot of dry canning in the mason jars, but I haven't done the water bath, which is something I plan on doing starting this summer. It's been delayed, but I'm gonna get to it. I've been sick for over a week and I'm finally getting better, but I wanted to film this um, and get it done or else it'll take a few more days. So here we go. All right, so for Augustin Farms, there are basically nine categories. There's the super can, meat, entree slash soup, vegetables, fruit, baking, grains, dairy, and drinks. My goal is to get 72 cans total. I believe I have 50. Uh, two are still on the way. And so that means I have another 20 cans that I still need to get. And my goal is to get them by this time next year. So two years total of getting all these cans. And the reason for that is because of budget. And so I'll show that in the next video, how I budgeted for these and how I tracked them. The reason I chose Augustin Farms was because one, I'm a prime member and it was just easier to send it to my house. Number two is that I liked, I like their color coding and their categories. It's very, um, it was very easy for me to, uh, schedule out what I wanted to get. So here you can see it's meat and it has this kind of orange color and icon. Entrees is like a green, like a mint green and a pot. Uh, the super cans is this yellow. And vegetables, you got the carrot and purple type of color. Uh, fruit is green, uh, baking is pink with that icon. And then the grains is kind of this brown with that icon. Uh, dairy, this one, the milk and the glass and kind of a purplish blue. And then the drinks are obviously drinks like the milk and then um, this one here. This one actually has a color and icon. See, drinks like the water. And the third reason I chose Augustin Farms was after, before I purchased any, I looked at the different um, prices and bottom line, it came to budget. But since then, uh, everything has gone up in price. So, but that was the original reason. And so let me get through, uh, let me show you what I have. Okay, so for super cans, they have these pouches. And um, I decided to go ahead with the super cans because I just wanted, I wanted something that was even more ready-made. So this is creamy chicken rice and then creamy stroganoff. Okay, lasagna. I was so excited about this. Okay, and then I do have pinto beans that are on the way. My goal is to have eight of each type of uh, category. And the reason for that is because that's what fits in my closet there, my long-term pantry. Okay, for meat, we have this chicken flavored vegetarian meat substitute, beef flavored vegetarian substitute, taco flavored vegetarian meat substitute, and freeze dried white meat chicken. For the entree soup, this is a gluten-free black bean burger mix, chicken fettuccine alfredo kit, Southwest chili mix, cheesy broccoli soup mix, vegetable stew blend. This is one of their best sellers and creamy, creamy potato soup mix. 
And so you can see from here, I have six. So I still need two. And the reason I haven't had those yet is I'm just waiting for things to go on sale and I want to not have the same one. So I'm waiting for those particular ones. For the veggies, you see I have all eight. So I'm, I'm gonna get the rest of the stuff first before I start on the veggies again, or I might do something different. So for now, my ultimate goal is to have the 72. And then from there, I might do something else, whether it's more canning or getting the bigger buckets. Chopped onions, potato shreds, sweet corn, potato gems, which is like mashed potatoes, okay. uh, bell peppers, red and green, potato slices. Yeah, those would be good for meals and sides. Okay, spinach flakes and tomato powder. So when I first started getting these, I made sure to get one or two cans of different categories at a time versus finishing one category first. And that's because if I were to use these like today or tomorrow, I would have, you know, a, a complete meal just from these cans aside from the other things that I have in my prepper pantries. All right, for the fruit, uh, I have seven. I have one more I'm waiting on and those are the grapes and those have just been such a high price right now. Um, and so I'm waiting. I've been waiting, waiting, and we've been waiting for months. But this is what I have. Luckily, um, the good thing with Augustine Farms is that they put things on sale. And But anyway, I'll show you that in the next video. Okay, here we have apple slices, whole blueberries, okay. banana chips, strawberries, sliced strawberries, whole red, uh, whole raspberries, diced mango. That was a nice, for me, that's like a treat. Okay, and then a pineapple. Now, if that's diced or chopped or whole, I mean, um, like the rings or sliced, I'm not sure, but it's pineapple. Okay, on to the baking. Baking was also easy to get all eight because they're a lower price point. Here we have a biscuit mix, no leavening. So when there's um, this, I think in the reviews, it said just to make sure you check the recipes because it will need uh, yeast. And so I do have yeast in my long-term pantry. Pancake mix, buttermilk pancake mix, brown sugar, blueberry flavored muffin mix. Now, if that means there's no actual blueberries, I don't know. Honey powder. Okay, I showed you that. And then I got two of these, the honey white bread scone and roll mix and blueberry flavored pancake mix. The grains are harder to come by. And I don't know if that's because I waited to this year to start getting them. Um, but they're, um, this one was a, a good price, but let's see. And I did wait for the peanut butter powder to go on sale. So I got two of those. And then this granola, that was, uh, that's not cheap. That This is at a very high price right now, but I got it when it went on sale. And so we got those four. And you can see that I still need another four of them. Okay, for the dairy, we have butter powder, scrambled egg mix, cheese blend powder, and dried whole egg powder. Now, for those of you asking or saying, why don't I just do these myself? It's much cheaper. Okay, yes, it is. It, it may be cheaper, but you have to have the time, you have to have the equipment, You and uh, for me, mostly time. And so I wanted to do something in two years that would pack this part of my long-term pantry. And uh, like I said earlier, I'm doing uh, dry canning, I'm doing uh, canning, I'm, I'm planning to do canning. I was also um, dehydrating. And so things like that, it just takes time. Um, so I thought this is something that, you know, it's not just a one thing that I'm doing. You're, you're doing several, uh, a few things at a time 
uh, depending on your budget. So um, if you can freeze dry butter, uh, make it into powder and freeze dry it, all the power to you. All right, for the drinks, we have here low fat milk alternative, uh, non-fat dry milk, chocolate, low fat alternative milk, and orange delight. So what I am waiting on for this one for the drinks is the apple, the apple drink, and that has not been available for months. But once that becomes available, I, I'll add it to here. I'll probably add one more orange and then uh, one other milk and then a chocolate milk. Because I think that as far as drinks, that's all their uh, choices. You can go on Amazon to look at the August and Farms page to see the other food that they have available. Again, wait for my next video. I'm gonna show you how to track and purchase these, wait for sales, and the total amount that I've spent on these so far. Let me know in the comments below if you stock up on number 10 cans, what brand you use. This is not sponsored, but all of these on my own. Uh, let me know what types of food you get. And uh, when I'm not traveling, I'm prepping. So follow me for more and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.